from the park. Frankie, say hey. Hey. All right. It's battle box time. Yay! I love unboxing these boxes. It's fun. Yeah, it is. We only get one take at it. It is one take. All right, May as well see. be live. May as well be live. All right. No, this is uh, battle box mission ninety five. Yes. Or. January 2023, the very first for 2023. Exactly. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. What are we doing here? Well, I'm going to first use the knife that was in the last month's battle box, which was a killer knife. It's the Civivi Brazen. Wait, wait, killer knife? Okay, not really a killer knife. It's a really cool knife. The Brazen with the Damascus blade. One of the better knives of the boxes, in our opinion, because we like folders. So. Yeah. See that video. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Go for it. This is kind of a cool size this box. This is, Jack. I was going to say, it's a good size box. We couldn't do this one uh, from the car. No. You know what? This would probably fit at least four to five cats in it. Cats? Uh-huh. You know how cats love boxes? Yeah. Uh, it's made ooh, in the I like what I see already. Okay. All right. Okay, mission 95. So if you guys don't know, or if this is the first time you've ever watched a Battle Box video, there's different tiers. So in each sex tier, you get different things in them. So Basic Box, Advanced Box, Pro Box, and I'm trying to not see what's in it. The Pro Plus oh, Box. the Pro Plus, yeah. yeah. Where you usually get a knife. I kind of saw something. Don't cheat. Hey, no, it was your fault. Your fault. All right. Okay, I'm going to start no, this at is... the top. This is the Pro Plus. Yes. Um, they go for 170. Uh -huh. The idea, real quick, for BattleBox. Yes. You pay, let's say 170 in this case. Uh -huh. You're gonna get stuff that equals maybe close to 300. Right. Exactly. So overall, it's a good deal. And what we have learned over the past few of them, probably the last year of Battle Boxes, yeah, it's a lot of stuff that we didn't know that we needed. That you will find, yes. And you some find stuff we don't even know what it is. We'll gear, gear and supplies that you didn't necessarily know that you needed. Uh -huh. um, and then, of course, the knife of the month, you always need that. Yes, exactly. What okay. is this? I'm starting with this one. This is Aqua Tabs Water Purification Tablets. Oh, okay. Oh. Purifying Tablets. Okay. The world's dams, lakes, and streams are teeming with microorganisms that threaten human health. These organisms can cause gastrointestinal disorders, among numerous things. So yes, if you have to drink outside water, you want to put one of these tablets in it. Okay, one tablet for four gallons. How many tablets do you get? There's a hundred of them. Okay. And it says that you, within 30, you put a tablet in water, drinking water, and within 30 minutes you can drink it. And you can drink it completely clear. Okay. Um, this will be good to have around the house. This mm -hmm. is good to have in your emergency get home bags or your emergency kits. Yes, exactly. Yeah, all right. Cool. Or you would if you travel to like questionable countries where their drinking water is not the best. This would be the thing to bring with you too. Something to have in your kit. Because, oh, should I tell this story? Because my sister went to Mexico. She brought back a worm. Let's just say... She brought back a worm? It, she digested this worm. <laughs> and it came out one other end. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, sister. That's Details. The story. Details. Okay, yeah, but thank if you. if she had this, it wouldn't have happened. <laughs> Water purification, that's what it's all about. Okay? Okay. Sweet. Wooks, all-in-one tactical gear cleaner. Let's go dig it in here. Gear cleaner. Okay. okay. And we have a Wooks... Um, that was a fixed blade last a few months back too. Remember it's that? It's a spray. It includes a brush and it's got it's got a cloth. Okay. Oh, and a toothbrush. Do not toothbrush? use this for your teeth. Probably not. Oh, that's kind of a nice brush though, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. So for your gear, mm -hmm. your firearms, your different uh, outdoor supplies. All it's in one type of gear yeah. cleaner. They're showing an axe, they're showing a knife. Mm hmm. Like rubber handles. Okay. All right. Does it have an odor? Like you. 
I took a shower <laughs> the other day. <laughs> Last month. No. It doesn't? Not really. It kind of just smells like, I don't know, like windshield cleaner. Okay. You know what I mean? Like it doesn't have like a strong odor at all. Sure. Okay. All around gear cleaner. It's got a cloth in there. Oh. I have this weird thing about... Foam. Frankie can't well, touch foam. Well, and um, I have the same thing about some... Okay, this one's not too bad. Um, some microfibers, I have a really weird thing about touching it too because it like sticks to your hands. So this one's not bad. I can touch this one, guys. Don't worry. Okay. Was... All right. No, that's okay. Go ahead. No, wooks. If, if, <laughs> wooks, wooks. yes. Yeah. If you've watched the channel for a while, you know this. <laughs> hey, look. It's got the wooks logo on it. Right where your hand was. Well, just the tag? The tag. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. That is kind of a, it has a nice little handle thing too. Okay. All nice. Right. All right. Okay. Gear so, cleaner. Gear cleaner. With brush and towel. Okay. This next item. No, this is still part of the oh, basic yeah. box. Shoot. I wanted to get into the next thing. Go okay. ahead. Go I'm for jumping it. ahead. I see something that looks really cool. Okay. The next one is Camo Corpse Chamois Bundle. Frankie says corpse. What should I say? Core. Core. Well, don't you want to pronounce the P? <laughs> Shut up. I, I think it's going to be uh, mixed opinions on that one. Okay. You guys know me by now. I kind of butcher words all the time. Okay. Oh, there's three. Okay. So what are they? Shammy. They are shammies. Look at They spell it S-H-A-M-M-Y. The the spelling for shammy class is, is, uh, is C-H something. C-H-A-M. Capital P Q. You. Uh, Frankie's going in a weird direction with it. Well, but I didn't know that either. A chamois cloth. Okay. Yes. Okay. The most forgotten item for typo for the typical outdoor enthusiast is some sort of product to wipe down, clean, and dry things. So here's an amazing trio that you can use. So it's a kitchen one, a, s a sponge, and then a field chamois. So those Where's are the, the sponge? sponges. Is it more than one? Yeah, there's two in there. There's two sponges? Yeah. Okay, and then kitchen chamois and then field chamois. Let me open these guys up. Now, can you touch this? Yes, I can. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. No, I, you should know how weird I am by now. Don't cut the cloth. I'm trying to not cut the cloth. Cut towards your partner. Yeah, exactly. All right, here is the field one. I like how it has the carabiner on it, too. It does have a carabiner. Nice. Okay, this is kind of nice. And you can tell that this is super moisture absorbing material. So what does it weigh? Just like an ounce or two, you know? Yeah. It's going to absorb 20 times its weight. Yeah, that is really water nice. Or whatever, whatever liquid. We should kind of put these around the house. Like the kitchen one, I would completely put this in. Like a, so you, I think you get two of them in here. Two kitchen size ones. That yeah. should just go in the bathroom. We have the weirdest stuff around the house. Um, and then this one, could, these can go in the kitchen. Because we always need more towels. And if it's kitchen the, chamois, but you could use this for your outdoor kit. Yeah. Actually, Very those are really nice. Absorbent? Yeah. yeah that's going to absorb a lot of liquid. It really is. Well, if it's anything like a car chamois, it seems like you want to get them kind of wet. And then it absorbs even more. Yeah. yeah. So. Okay. Reusable, of course. Mm -hmm. Instead of paper towels. Okay, right. it says it can hold up to 15 times its weight. Hey, I was close. You were close, yes. I said 10 to 20 or something like yep. that. Yep. Okay. All right, well, cool. those three items are part of the basic box. All righty, so then the next item. What is it, thank you? I keep going around to... I want to get into the sleeping bag, literally. It is a sleeping bag, isn't yeah. it? What's this? This seems like such a cool idea. Here, yeah, set it on the table so everybody can see. Okay, so this is bone dry rust rust prevention handgun case. So it's for firearms. Yes. Could you use it for knives? You can use it for anything. Is it just a normal case, or is there something special about it? It absorbs moisture. Okay. Which I don't really understand, but that would be the coolest thing ever for, say, my 
knives that corrode really easily. Such as? All my D2 knives. Put them all in here. D2 knives. But yeah, so you can, it has substance to it. It almost feels like it's, you, like you can feel the, the moisture absorber in there. Yeah. Oh, that actually was a really cool idea. What, uh, do we know the cost on any of these? Individually we Oh, don't. you know what, doesn't it so... Oh, you're looking ahead. I, sorry, I didn't mean to. I went to, I wanted to see if it, because usually I thought it said what it, how much they are individually. Maybe not this time. Okay, for storing and preventing um, moisture with, uh, preventing rust with moisture. Heavy duty industrial, 800D PVC nylon. Okay. You know what's interesting too? Hmm. It can be recharged. So if it takes a lot of moisture, and so if you put something in there that's like super wet, you put it out in the sun or dry with a hair dryer on low heat to recharge it. I think the term recharge is just another to way of saying dry it. Dry it. Yep. Dry it. it, yeah. Okay. Okay. You could fit something like a Glock mm -hmm. in there. Or, you know, D2 hand uh, pocket knives. Well, and it has like the nice little stuff that you can just, and then you can throw like some fixed blades in there too. That'd be really cool. Yeah. Okay. Neat. All right, pretty cool. Okay. Bone Next dry. Up. What do we have? The Pro Block box. Okay, yeah, that was the advanced. So you get the three items in the basic box plus the bone dry um, handgun case mm -hmm. in the advanced. So on to the Pro. Pro Box. You get a sleeping, sleeping bag. bag. Now what's so special about this one? Wild Aspen 20. What's the temperature rating? It's a mummy style. 20 degrees, that's pretty good. Yeah. It's pretty lightweight for the size of it. Um, and water repellent, it's a good mummy one. Wild Aspen 20. I was gonna say, it's uh, fairly compact. Hopefully mm -hmm. I could fit in there. Well. Being six foot two. I don't know why you always say that you're six foot two. Why not? You're three. Six foot three? Yep. I think it's more like six two and a half. She rounds Round it. Round up, guys, and we always know that. <laughs> Round up. All right, we're gonna get this thing out. I guess so. <laughs> I like the color of it. It's kind of like this. I don't know. Would you call it like a sagey? You know colors color? better than I do. What do you call it? Sage, aqua foam, <laughs> sea foam, sea foam green. Here, oh, hold I it. Bet I'll probably fit in this. Hold it up. Do you think I could in this? This looks like my height or so. Now, yeah, I was gonna say, that's the, yeah. this is the feet end Yeah. here. Does it give you a little room to move your feet around? Yes. Yeah. And look, the zipper goes down to there. I don't know, I like the color of it too, it's pretty. Cause I know guys, you want a pretty sleeping bag. It's essential. Uh, um, for sleeping bags, we have a couple, yeah. but they're getting old. You're gonna wear. <laughs> you're gonna wear it. Cold out. It is thirty some degrees when we're filming this. Nice. Okay, it is nice though. I like it. It's good. I wish I knew how much these cost individually. Yeah. Because this looks like uh, a decent one. It doesn't look cheap. Yeah. And you know what? When it's this cold out, some of this stuff is so good to just keep in your car. Yeah. You know, like when it's thirty degrees snowstorms well definitely depending on who you are and what kind of commute or drive you have every day yeah. keeping a sleeping bag in your car may, may be a really good idea it really is yeah Especially warmth, these. warmth to weight ratio is something they're bragging about here mm. lightweight and durable okay. micro polyester shell this is always the question no we're not going to do that on the video you can get it back in a lot of them have these stuff i don't want to add 10 minutes to the video while you stuff this in there. That's what you said last night. 
<laughs> to the video. <laughs> okay. See, see our other see, channel. See the other channel. <laughs> I see this is, people wonder why, where we edit. This is where we edit. No, and then you say you're going to edit, and then you just don't. No, I, a lot of times I say I'm going to edit, and we do. Oh. Well, you're editing the 10 minutes, right? This is, we're at 15 minutes or so. No, that it took for me to stuff it in. Huh. That wasn't bad. I was actually impressed. That's what you said last night. I'm impressed. <laughs> that was nice. I like it that they're actually stuffable nowadays. Zipper draft tube ensures the cold air stays out so you sleep soundly all through the night. Okay. See, I got it back in. Look. Perfectly good. Not bad. Okay. Okay. What's the next item? Well, that was the Pro Box. So okay. everything you get there now. Okay. The next do, 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 do. edition is Pro Plus, which includes the knife of the month, which is a Spyderco. It is a Spyderco lightweight. I'm impressed. So it's a resilience lightweight. The resilience. All right. Okay. Let's grab this thing out of there. Do we own a resilience? I don't think we do. <laughs> we have, I don't know, probably 30 different Spydercos. I don't know if we own a resilience. Yeah. Okay, that is a big spider co. That's your size spider co. This is, um, that's going to be a four inch blade. You know what's nice? We got lucky. We got the flat edge. Some of them get serrated. In the, yeah. in this kit, they uh -huh. come serrated? Yeah. Subscribers may get one of the two blade options. Needs, needs breaking in, but. Okay, spider co's are always great knives. I would now, say that's like 60 to $80 or so. It's set up tip down. I never carry tip down. Uh oh. But look, you can you can uh, modify it for tip up. I think these are four way modificator. Modificating. Like, Is modificating. Is your word? Modificating. Yes. Yes, they are. So good for left hand carry too. All right, nice. But yeah, that's a nice big old blade. Well. And it is a little lightweight, so. What's the blade still on these? No, I'm not. these are. They're the budget brand. It is budget. 8 CR13 MOV. Okay. Yep. Which isn't terrible. No. I like the knife a lot. Yeah. The size. The blade style. Mm-hmm. Liner lock. FRN handle. FRN scales. Mm-hmm. Signature spidey hole. Okay. I don't know. It's nice. Overall length is 9.4 inches, closed is 5.2. I think this is the biggest option of the of the lightweight budget line. Budget line. Of the yeah. line, yeah, yeah. Because that's probably almost like the same size as a police, would you say? Or would you say, or like a, probably between a, a paramilitary two and a police. A police in length is going to be the same. It's probably going to be a little slimmer. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the police is, oh, I want to say, VG10. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Here, let's compare right. it to the brazen size. Whoa, it makes him look teeny. <laughs> the brazen is probably an average average size knife. All right. Yeah, okay. I think that's a pretty good box this month. Those are the last two months yeah. of BattleBox Pro Plus. Keep these knives coming, BattleBox. Yeah, they're good. Yep, we like them. They know they're knives. I know, yep. All right. Okay. Well, that's pretty cool. I'm excited to test this out with some knives. I was impressed. Yeah. The chamois are nice. Water pur purification, we need to actually get serious and distribute them uh, yeah. different places accordingly. Yeah. I'm really, I'm looking forward to this a lot because I, we always need another knife carrying case and this one would be a really good idea. So yeah. I'm kind of curious um, of how it works. You can that's feel what the the absorbing absorbing in there yeah yeah like you really can it's kind of a deep idea yeah all right good stuff okay neat where's the booklet um i think it's in the box yeah i think they wrote it in here yeah okay right okay anything else nope that's it that's mission brief 95 yeah so you might end up with a serrated yep okay partial serrated partial serrated which if you're an outdoorsy person It'd be handy. Serrations are fine. It I would just, be handy. I just get annoyed sharpening them. Yeah.
but I'm I'm a wuss. Yeah. yeah. Hey, you're the one that just called me a wuss, but whatever. Here, you carry this one now. I will. Okay. What Do have it. I got today? I've got a I've got a Hogue Deca. Oh yeah. Is my okay. EDC today, but this is gonna join. What are you looking for? I saw trash. I was gonna pick it up. We're in the park. Yeah. Oh, I went to I went to carry this tip down. It's tip up. Oh yeah. <laughs> nice pants, by the way. There we go. Hey, we got the we got this delivery. We seriously just ran. I like uh, how I make fun of your outfit when um I have quite the weird look going. Yeah, here's Frankie. <laughs> if you made it to the end of the video and you're seeing Frankie's uh, attire, give us a thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah. All right. No, that's okay. it. Battlebox 95. If you've made it this far, make sure you subscribe. And thanks a lot for joining us.